Hey everybody, it's the Boss Lady here coming to you real quick with another fall decor video. So right now I'm in my entryway because this is what you have seen thus far. But today I would like to take you into my dining room only to show you my china cabinet. So if you're ready for a quick decor video, just stay tuned. I am first going to start off at the top of my china cabinet, so I'll try to give you a full-on view. So I have some inexpensive pumpkins up there. I think one I purchased from Walmart, maybe one or two, and the others got from the thrift store. That picture you see up top where it says pumpkin patch, let me step to the side so you can see it better. The leaf is <laughs> covering the pea. But anyway, um, I did that as a DIY. I picked up a calendar, 2021 calendar, and I just took that picture out of it and put it in a frame. So that's a full Dollar Tree DIY right there. And then I just have some garland sitting up there. Um, one quick tip, if you need to have some risers, use your candles. So I have two... Bath and Body Works candles up top with the orange pumpkin sitting on them just to give them a little bit of height. So yeah, so that's the top of my china cabinet. So now I will give you an overview and then take you inside. This is my china cabinet for fall 2020. Wanted to do something quick, nothing too fancy. Uh, my bottom shelf is hold, holding some dishes as well as just two pumpkins. But this is what it looks like, and I like it. So let me take you inside. Okay, so the first shelf, uh, very inexpensive shelf. The chargers that you see in the back, I got those, I believe, at a thrift store last year in 2019. The plates also was a, hmm, they were a thrift find, uh, inexpensive last year. And then the plates Pumpkin plates, those are from Pier 1, but I also got those at the thrift store. So this shelf, very inexpensive. The picks are from Walmart. So I'll get a little closer so you can see the picks. My little scarecrow from Dollar Tree. And then there is another pick. I didn't want to do too much on this shelf, just give it a little bit of a fall feel. My second shelf, I have my soup terrain. I got that while thrifting. I also have two more picks in there, same as the first shelf from Walmart. And then I have some Dollar General light up pumpkins just to give it a little bit of light on this shelf. And that's it. And now my bottom shelf, I have, of course, my, <laughs> my punch bowl. That's a Pioneer Woman punch bowl with the glasses. So because this is a china cabinet that is well functioning, not just for decor purposes, I did leave some dishes in here. So I have my punch bowl and glasses there. I also have uh, some dishes here, my clear dishes, the plates, salad plates, and the bowls. And then over in the corner, I have some glasses from Dollar Tree. Um, all of the dishes that you see on this bottom shelf, I got thrifted. Well, everything but the glasses. Uh, so these dishes here I got from the thrift store, my Pioneer Woman punch bowl and glasses. I got those from the thrift store and then these glasses here from the Dollar Tree. And then my pumpkins that you see, this one says give thanks and the other one, okay, and that pumpkin, it says harvest blessing. Um, I have it pushed over more to the corner so you can see it through the glass though. Um, I was going to put the punch bowl uh, behind the glass so that I could have the pumpkins in the middle, but the punch bowl is quite large, so therefore it wouldn't fit. So that's why it seems a little off kilter, but that's okay. I'm loving it just the way it is. So this is my china cabinet. I'm going to close the door. I want you to see how it looks with the lights off. So it has a little glow there. Yep. So once again, this is my china cabinet for 2020. Didn't want to do too much. Didn't want to spend too much money. I think only thing that was purchased this year were the Pioneer 
or no, not excuse me, the Pier 1 plates from the thrift store, as well as my picks. Everything else I had on hand. And I've had for at least a year to two. If you've been following me, um, you've seen these items. Actually, every item in here you've seen in a haul. But this is my pumpkin patch for 2020. So thank you all for watching. Thank you for subscribing. If you're new to the channel, I am Sharon, also known as the Boss Lady. And I would love for you to become one of the Boss Ladies of the Boss Land. So hit that subscribe button, share the video, like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> and I'll see everybody in a new video. Bye, guys.